G'day fellas and welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since I put one of these up and uh, I decided to get my uh, butt back into gear and start putting these up again. I'm not going to promise that they'll be regular because my personal life is erratic and I don't always get time for this sort of stuff because obviously work, study, wife, kids, blah 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 blah. But anyway, uh, I'd like to introduce to you Feet Food from the Clan Pepcac, which is the clan I'm part of on the Southeast Asian server or the Asia server. Depends on who you ask. Feet is playing in this uh, wonderful heavy tank called the E100, the tier 10, one of the tier 10 heavy tanks for the Germans. Um, I, I quite like this tank. I haven't got one yet. I've played it on some accounts and I've played it on the test server. And it's got a really nice gun. Now, Feet has got a bit of a reputation with us, so um, before anything, I'm just going to have to give this uh, disclaimer. Just uh, put that out there, feet. You need to be kicked. Anyway, um, for those. Also, Fwaken is basically. If one of us swears, it's just a. Um, <laughs> one way of swearing, basically. Anyway, so first up, we see a Codway. And that's why we like the, this gun, because it does 750 average damage. Has about 230 millimeters of pen, which is not amazing for a tier 10 gun, but that can be offset with, um, uh, sorry, compensated with uh, heat. Although some players are quite good at not using heat, and as you see there, you didn't need heat to go through that heavy tank. Although it is only a tier 8 premium tank. So in this game, you're going to see feet. This is, this is not going to be one of those amazing games where you see him get 12 kills and. Uh, beat a whole team. Basically he's going to just do what you should do in a heavy tank. This is a great example of this. He's going to hold a corner against multiple tanks and he's going to keep them pinned down. I'm not going to tell you how much damage he does. He does a fair few bit of damage. But this just shows you a above average game and how you should play it. Like, he's not full on going full retard like he normally does. But he's just Sitting there, taking his damage where he needs to, and putting in the shots when he's reloaded. The great thing about this tank is you can just hide and you have some great armour while you're reloading, so you're not very well, not as vulnerable as other tanks. Now, he did miss that shot there against the uh, T62A, and he just took it early. Now, this is, uh, this is from 2016, this replay. He sent me this. In September 2016, this is how but far behind I am on replays. I've also had like 20 replays pre-recorded with um, with video and audio, and not with my voice though, unfortunately. But uh, and as you can see, the recording's a bit off because the edges are a bit wrong, and there might be some jitteriness in the uh, replays because I think this is before or around the time I had an issue with my video card. Um, but yeah, so yeah, E100, great tank, um, really cool looking tank, it's almost looks like a massive brick really. <laughs> so as you can see, I think he's up to 4700 damage, I, I actually can't see very well, the preview is a bit blurry on mine because my um, GPU is not powerful enough to uh, run a full HD copy of what I'll be using. He just misses out on that kill on the T92. Uh, he's, he's, not, he's not done yet. Now, well, I've got to say, I like Cliff. It's a nice map. It's not too... Cor like, it, it's corridory, but there's at least different ways you can play it. Like, there's at least four or five different ways you can play it. Um, but it does depend on your tank and what you're using. So, take that with a grain of salt. The, the, I guess the frustrating thing about this replay is I can't actually talk much about it because he's not doing anything particularly wrong here. He's being cautious. He probably could be a little less cautious, but at the same time, his team's winning. He's done plenty of damage. And really, the, this tank is not about rushing. Like, it is about rushing out, but it's not, it's not like a medium tank. You can't get there at 50 kilometers an hour and do loads of damage. It's, you've got to be careful and you got to think your, your movements through because if you get caught out, you're pretty much dead. Oh, that. 
I, I don't know about you as well, but the gun sounds. I don't know if this was modern gun sounds or not, looking back, because I cannot remember. But I just think they're amazing. Well, we're nearly at the end of the replay, and uh, I, I'm going to have another disclaimer here, uh, shortly. I'm sure editing will be done there. There we go. Um, he's, he's about to do some team damage, but uh, we don't endorse it. Oh, unless we have to reset the battle buddy. Anyway, let's go to the game. Well, as we can see, that was a first class victory, which was uh, quite good. Although you require quite a bit for a uh, masterclass, I think, on these uh, games. So he got Steel Wall, and we'll see how much he bounced. He got uh, 1,012 experience, sorry, 2,012 experience for uh, Double Win, which is good. Uh, he got 60k without premium, which is nice. So he did 6,118 damage, 2 kills, and he got 1,007 XP. Not amazing, not terrible, but still, that, that was a good game. That, that's a really good game there. Having a look at his, this, he hit 5 13 shots, hit 10 and pen 10. This thing's pretty nasty. I mean, it, it, against most medium tanks, it will pen because overmatch in some cases, and also just it's just a big gun. Um, he got one shot in from over 300 meters. This this gun's not overly accurate, so that's it's not an easy feat to maintain. He can do that. He did do 801 damage to allies, but we won't talk about that feat. That's okay. He got uh, oh, he got 1826 spotting damage. He blocked 2375 um, damage with his armor. So, yeah, and he uh, travelled... What is tra his travel distance? Oh, yeah, 1.22 kilometres. That's quite far. That's, uh, that's good. <laughs> anyway. Um, so, yeah, as I said, guys, uh, going to try and make this a bit more regular than I have been. Stop being such a pain in the ass and actually do some actual work and put some replays out. This is one of probably two I'll put out this week um, and then there might I might be quiet for a week because I'm getting all four of my wisdom teeth out so that's gonna be fun uh, not really oh, I probably wouldn't recommend it I'll tell you after the surgery and when I can talk and function as a human being and so um, till next time uh, take care and have fun <laughs>